Hello everyone, my name's John Dewar, I'm the Vice-Chancellor of La Trobe University and I'm taking this opportunity to wish everyone a very happy 50th birthday. Whether you're a student at La Trobe or a member of staff at La Trobe or one of our alumni or friends and supporters, all of us I think can be rightly proud of what this university has achieved over the last 50 years and that we're now able to celebrate. The university started life on the outskirts of the northern suburbs of Melbourne. At the time, what was then a, a paddock, really, nothing more than that, with some cows grazing peacefully, and then the bulldozers moved in and a university was born. When we first enrolled our initial cohort of 552 students and installed our chancellor on March the 8th, 1967, a day that is now International Women's Day. That first intake of students in 1967 contained some wonderful alumni who are now household names. People like Don Watson, Bill Kelty, David Morgan, and many others. The university today is, of course, very different from 50 years ago. We're much larger. We now have 33,000 students spread across six campuses, stretching from Collins Street in the CBD of Melbourne right up to Mildura and Albury-Wodonga in the north of Victoria. But something special about La Trobe has remained throughout that period. A willingness to take risks, to do the unconventional, and to embrace diversity and inclusiveness in the university. That remains every bit as important a part of the modern day La Trobe as it was back then in 1967. One of La Trobe's great achievements over the last 50 years has been to combine that inclusiveness and adventurousness with becoming what is undoubtedly now one of the world's leading research universities. We are, after all, now ranked in the top 400 on all three of the major ranks of universities. That's the first time that's ever happened in the history of La Trobe. So whether you're attending the Lawn Lunch or the Hillis Maris Lecture or the Staff and Student Barbecue or all three of those, let's all join in the celebration of the wonderful things that this university has achieved over its first 50 years and let's reflect on the exciting possibilities that await us for the next 50.